Welcome everyone to my channel. This is an updated version of my Stanley Real vs Fake video. I didn't expect the last video to get so many views and I apologize for the quality. I will do my best to make it clear and brief. My goal was to educate and help you spot the differences between a real and a fake Stanley, especially since many people are buying from different websites because they couldn't find the limited edition they wanted. Like many of you, I bought a fake Stanley and didn't realize it until I had it in my hands. After that, I did a lot of research to learn how to spot the difference. Today, I'm going to show you how to detect a real versus a fake Stanley. I recently bought a new Stanley from the official website, but unfortunately, I threw away the box, as I wasn't planning on making an updated video. On the left side, we have the fake Stanley and on the right side, the real one. I wish I had the original box to compare, but from what I know, the logo on the real box is positioned lower and the sticker quality is better. I apologize for not having a visual example. Both come with instructions. and you can see a clear difference in the logo placement. The fake Stanley logo starts about an inch lower than the real one, which starts half an inch down. Another key difference is the handle. The fake Stanley handle sits about half an inch lower, and the quality is noticeable worse. In a real Stanley, the straw always comes inside the bottle, which the fake ones often come with a straw in a plastic package. You may also notice a small bump on the lid of the fake one, which is not well aligned. This bump doesn't appear on the real Stanley. The screws on the fake one aren't aligned correctly either. But they are aligned on the real one. The bottom of the Stanley bottles looks quite similar. I also won't compare the labels since they are different versions and I'm not sure how the real version of the fake one looks. The real Stanley has a recycled logo at the bottom, while the fake one has a sauce logo, which stands for suspicious, of course. <laughs> I'm kidding. I hope this video is useful. There are better imitations out there, and some are so close you can barely tell the difference. But please be careful, fake Stanleys may be cheaper, but you don't know what materials they are made of, and they could be toxic or harmful. Try to buy from the official Stanley website or their official Amazon store. They sometimes have sales and it's easier to purchase safely. I hope you find this video useful. Happy drinking! I will be unboxing the limited Love Shack Fancy Stanley in my next video. I purchased three different versions, so make sure you subscribe for more Stanley reviews and accessories. Goodbye!